What's good, YouTube? I just got back from training. I haven't taken a shower yet, but I wanted to record this first part, this intro, so y'all can get a little idea what this video is about. Because some people just be clicking on videos and don't, they don't be reading, bruh. They just, excuse me, they don't be reading the fucking titles at all. They just don't care. So let me explain this to y'all. Basically, this video is about the Verbally's um, video. Allegedly, this nigga paid 50K to let some... I don't know. Someone made an animation that was kind of not safe for work. And I guess he wanted to like be animated having some animated female crazy about him. It's about a has been hotel, bro. I don't know what the fuck that shit is supposed to be called, but has been hotel. And then the female that plays in it is fucking animated. And she's, you know, obsessed with verbalies or some shit. And I guess. He paid for that shit. I don't know what the fuck the idea was behind that shit, but like, that's what he did. And we just gonna talk about it in this video. So, uh, this long ass intro, excuse me, but some people need this shit because they just don't like reading. All right, so let's talk, bro. So basically, I went to do a little bit more research, came to find out, probably the guy actually asked his fans to fund the beatbox series the, the battles so he could make more videos now i understand where it's coming from where people are mad because from my point of view what i got out of this is it's just people heard something and that shit spread like a wildfire but now that i'm hearing it from different sides and i'm seeing what's actually going on even though i haven't seen any receipts is basically this nigga used the money that the fans gave him to support the series for the beatbox whatever series battles and he just used it for some i don't know some goofy ass animation basically that would not benefit his fans because they don't support that shit so now he's in a situation where he's like yo you 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 fucking with our money bro we gave you that money but then again even if he asked you that money bro you was never obligated to give him that money so you cannot you can be mad at him, but he has no value. You being mad has no value. Because if I ask you for money, if a, no, no, better yet, let me get a better example. If a crackhead asks you for money, you give the crackhead some money and he buys crack, you gonna be mad at him? You know he's a crackhead. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> the nigga's on the street for a reason, bruh. And I seen the nigga series. He be pulling mad views. I refuse to believe he's not making no money out of that shit. He has to be getting some type of income out of that shit. And he has a lot of subscribers too. He has skills. He can make income. There's no way this nigga's not getting no income off of YouTube. Unless they're straight striking his shit back to back, which they probably not doing. There's no reason for him to not be making no money off of just YouTube itself. So him begging the community, as some people claim, to get money, he probably just finessed the fuck out of y'all. And if he did that, he is fucked up for that. But y'all stupid too. Because it's not like all his videos are getting striked or some shit. He don't be cussing. I don't remember him cussing in his videos. He just be making noises. But yeah, um, that's just my opinion on this shit. I think this is a very idiotic ass situation. People are spending too much time and attention on this. And uh, y'all should just focus on your own life, bro. Because at the end of the day, he had that 50k. You still don't. So, yeah, you can say what you want about, oh, he's irresponsible with money, blah, blah, blah. He's using our money for bullshit. Well, you're broke. You put your money into that shit. Ain't nobody asked you to do that. And even if you ask, if he asked you to do that shit, nigga, you can choose for yourself. You made that decision. That's your L. And you best hold that shit. You can crucify that nigga all you want, bro. He's still living a better life than you. Sorry to say, as, as I'm, so, I'm sorry I'm saying it the way I'm saying it, but that's just how it is. Y'all have a nice day.